All right, uh, welcome back to another episode with Webflow with Waldo. Uh, so today we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, instead of a live stream, I wanted to record the whole process of building out a site based upon a Figma design or a sketch design uh, going into Webflow. So I wanted to kind of record what that process was like. Uh, because I'm on a, a Windows machine, I had to import the sketch file into Figma, then export all the assets, and then add that to Webflow and do that whole process. So I'll walk through that as I'm doing it. Um, but a, about a month ago, uh, I was looking on Twitter, and I, I follow uh, Ryan Reynolds on there. He's got, got a lot of funny uh, material. Um, and he, he's also the owner of Aviation Gin. So uh, being web designer developer, you know, it's really interested in like what their website looked like because um, it, it sounded like a really fun brand. So I, I went and took a look at the website and um, team's done a, a, a great job behind that. Um, it, it just, it kind of looked a little bit outdated. And so that, that kind of gave me the idea to maybe do a redesign and build it out in Webflow. And eventually I'm gonna tweet this out to Ryan and see how he takes that. <laughs> uh, they, they might love it, they might hate it, they might send me a cease and desist, but uh, we're just having fun here. <laughs> so <laughs> hopefully they enjoy it. Um, but I messaged my buddy Jeff Black, uh, who I've worked with on several projects now, where he's he's an amazing designer, uh, does some just incredible work and really easy to work with. So I messaged him about this idea and was like, "Hey, would you mind you know connecting with me on this?" Um, and he was like, "Dude, that'd be awesome." So uh, Jeff spent the next you know two weeks or so compiling all the assets, doing some product cut cutouts, and then doing you know a whole redesign of the Aviation Gen website and he sent over the sketch file which i'm about to show over here in figma uh, but it, it just blew my mind i was like this is beautiful and i've been super excited to work on it uh, it's been a few crazy weeks so now i'm finally getting to it and i'm excited to share this with everyone so let's see if we hop on over i'm going to show here's the, like the current uh, aviation gen site um, with my face in the corner of course um, but it's really not not a bad site like it's a great looking website uh, it's responsive um it just looked like it needed a bit of an update um but that's also like part of the brand um really do enjoy it like that kind of like that older style brand and uh, really fun material to work with um some great photography <laughs> um but here without further ado here's uh the redesign which Jeff came up with. Uh, so it's these these two pages. We're only going to do like the home page and more of like a, a detail page, uh, or we might just end up doing like the one main landing page that we're going to tweet out. Um, we'll see where we land in the process. So I, I imported this file directly from Sketch into Figma by literally just like opening up a new file in Figma. I just like dragged in the, the Sketch file into Figma and it just just worked, which is amazing. Uh, amazing work over at the, the Figma team. Um, shout out to, to Jason over there. <laughs> um, but yeah, just like drag that in. I had to sync some local fonts, which took about 30 seconds. And then I just reloaded the, the project and everything seemed to work. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm still new to Figma. So this whole process is gonna be learning process for me. But here's like that hero section. Um, gonna make sure the camera doesn't time out on us over here. So, um, but as we kind of go through here, here's like that hero section, really nice navigation. Looks like this is gonna be a slider uh, as well as having like the, a video link right here. Um, and like a little CTA to scroll down. And of course that uh, by now CTA. Um, in this section, we kind of like uh, go over some of the uh, facets of uh, Aviation Gin and how it's like the process behind it or more, more like the story behind like the small batch. Um, and then in the next section, kind of talking more about the production, um, walking through that and have a nice little copy section as well as that, that video. Uh, then as we go further down, we see um, more of the cocktails. And here it shows like the 
name of the cocktail, all the ingredients, and then an image of that cocktail. These are all placeholder images, so might need to, to shoot a few, and I think some of them are pulled directly from the current website. Really love the way that Jeff built out this section. It's gonna be fun to make it all responsive. Uh, so it'll look good on all the different devices. Likely gonna use a mix of um, some CSS grid or um, Flexbox styles to make this all work. This will be fun. Um, and then down here is a whole section on Old Tom. Um, just a nice headline. I love the typography styling that Jeff did here. And I love this footer. Um, you know, talking about flying responsibly. Um, and then uh, also being able to find um, this uh, Aviation Gen product near you. That's really important. I want to make that really easy. Um, so yeah, let's scroll over to this other iteration over here. All right, this one is really like more of a product focus. So this might be like a product detail page or like the origins page. Or I guess they're both technically like an origins page design. Um, so Jeff, you know, made two different designs. I'll probably end up building both of them just to see, you know, which one looks better um, once it's you know live and on the web. Um, this one is another slider here. It's got some controls down here uh, as well as like little arrows really like showcasing that product front and center. Um, and again, like covering that story. I love this branding work behind here. Um, I'm talking about the production. It's a different layout of that same content. Um, here's kind of a slider looking through the different cocktails. And I like this uh, like active state, like showing that there are more slides over here compared to that. Um, like, hey, this arrow is not going to work <laughs> type state over here. Um, and then there's another section talking about old Tom um, and that beautiful footer. So yeah, uh, it should be a really fun and exciting build. Uh, I'm excited to walk everyone through it and excited to share this with the world once it's ready. So yeah, let's get to it. Let's build an awesome website.